And it is time right now for our Rescues in Action segment. And we're over here with, uh, wow, <laughs> I think somebody has found her treat. She did. You didn't uh, hide it Charlie, very well. Charlie is here from uh, the Pet Pal Rescue in St. Petersburg, along with Megan and Martha Murray. We say welcome to you this morning. Tell us a little bit about what's going on with Charlie here. Well, thank you very much for having us. This little angel here She's is great. Charlie. <laughs> she is a three-year-old Boston Terrier mix. And she actually came to the shelter in October 2010. She had a skin condition called Demodex. Mm. And now that she has overcome the Demodex, she is ready to find and her forever home. Got her appetite back, too. <laughs> oh, Beautiful absolutely. Brindle color Isn't on she gorgeous star. with the yeah, white? She She's really is. And nice. a great temperament. She is just absolutely wonderful. She's going to do great in a home with children. She would also do well with dogs her size. So whoever is ready for this sweet, sweet girl, then please stop by Pet Pal Animal Shelter today. Our doors open at 10. Now, I know that you, you, you had mentioned earlier when you first came in that Charlie might be a little bit shy, but obviously I'm not. Not, not is, at all. She's definitely coming out of her shell this morning. Yes, she has. So this is... I'm very pleased for her, and she's just loved every second of all the attention that she's getting. Now, you say this is a rescue dog, so this is a dog that has had some problems, but obviously one that will adapt very well to a home situation. Oh, she will. Absolutely. And they, they do something very... Uh, what, what they do is actually give um, animals a second or a, what, maybe a third chance because mm -hmm. they actually go to some of the um, animal shelters that are full or have um, emergency cases that they don't have the ability to treat right there and then. And so they go in and take them and they do it and get them ready to go and so give them an, another, another chance to get out there. And huh. that really is important for dogs like this. Yeah. Still a lot of love to give and still would make somebody a great pet you can tell that she's used to being around right. other animals too she's not going to get really rambunctious on, on cue she'll just jump down right there <laughs> Yeah, she likes to do what she likes to do, but I do have to say that she does know her basic obedience commands, so you can have her sit. Um, she definitely is very treat motivated, so if you and have And I guarantee her, if you try that on air, it won't happen. <laughs> <laughs> she's if got If you a have the treat. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Very treat motivated, and of course the treat would be for that forever family. And to oh, do yeah. that, all they have to do is get in touch with uh, the uh, Pet Pals Adoption, and uh, that's at 727-328. Uh, 7738 in and, St. Petersburg. And if yeah. you can't adopt, um, what else could people do to help? Well, right now we are looking for wish list items for Pet Pal Animal Shelter, and we're looking for science diet cat and dog foods. Okay. Um, we're looking for different dog. Uh, dog treats, uh, dog bones, mm -hmm. uh, as well as keep we're looking fed, for... Keep keep them occupied, and keep them happy. Absolutely. That's okay, what they I do think for that... us, too. All right, that's the way it is as far as uh, the Pet Pal goes. And still to come on ABC Action News, we've got more ahead. We'll throw it back to you guys.